Yeah, hello from me and my cat. Well, today we're going to be looking at something a little bit different. You're right, Maggie. Um, so this is uh, unlike uh, normal sort of models and toys we look at. This is a set of um, mini sort of retro posters that uh, Big Chief, the uh, Big Chief Studios that do make the sort of twelve-inch uh, sort of high-end collectors figures from Doctor Who and Space 1999 and that sort of thing. Uh, and this was a set of promotional ones they did. I think it was limited uh, edition. Uh, it doesn't actually say on it. But these were uh, advertisers. I think they were some mad price, like 80 or 90 quid. Very limited edition. They were selling them at the con. They had a big box of them and they were selling them at five or set. So I thought, it's got to be worth getting one. So they come in a very nice... Uh, sort of envelope, but I've not really looked at these since I've uh, gone to the con. So I've got a cat on my lap who's very interested. You coming up here? Come on. Get my lap. No, she's all right. She's going to sit on my knee. So I'm trying to do this one handed while balancing a cat. You all right? Yeah? She's all right. So let's get these out. Let me just remove them from the bag. Actually, I'll get them out of the bag and we'll come back. Okay, so, like I say, they come in quite a sturdy envelope with one of these <coughs> sort of uh, string fastening systems. And let's get them out. Let's pop them out. Okay, so you actually get slightly more than I thought. You get some photos and a letter. Let's have a look, see what we've got. So, this is the Big Chief Studios, proud to present Doctor Who Retro Poster Collection. So, I think. This was done. They, they when they did season eight, series eight of Doctor Who, the the new one. They um, they seem to I seem to remember them doing saying each one was like a mini film. And I think this is probably for that. So it's difficult to see. So there we go. So two thousand sets were done, and this is number eight hundred and seventy one. It's signed by Stuart Manning, and that gentleman who's the one of the directors, or two of the directors, of Big Chief Studios. Don't know who they are. Nothing on the back. So you get that. That's very nice. Certificate of authenticity. Uh, you get a couple of stills. So these are like front of house stills. Was this stuff ever released at the cinema? I don't know. That's a nice still. It's Peter Capaldi at his uh, groin thrusting vest. Twelfth Doctor and Clara Oswald inside the TARDIS. So you get that one. And uh, oh, some Cybermen. So that's recreating the classic uh, in invasion uh, shot of the Cybermen coming down the steps of St. Paul's. It's nice, that would be a nice frame, that. The Mistresses. Mistresses. It's nice, I feel Mistress. Mrs. Newly activated Cybermen to send the steps from St. Paul's Cathedral in London. Now, what's this? So you get a letter. So, from BBC TV. Dear Doctor Who fan, Big Chief Studios Limited, in association with BBC Worldwide Limited, are pleased to enclose your Doctor Who retro poster collection, Series 8 print set. So, were these sent from the BBC then, rather than from Big Chief? Um, I don't know. So you get, oh, here we go. Originally commissioned by RadioTimes.com, the week of each episode's airing by artist Stuart Manning. Hello, what do you think of these? Can you see the letter? Oh, she's not really a big letter reader, is our cat. Uh, so, deep breath into the Dalek, Robert of Sherwood, listen, time heist, caretaker, kill the moon. Oh, that was a bad episode, wasn't it? Mutiny on, no, mutiny on the buses, no, mummy on the Orient express, flatline, in the forest of the night, dark water, death in heaven. Each W11, oh, wits, 11 inch by 14 inch art print is pr printed on high grade satin art stock with UV light stable inks, suitable for framing. Well, let's have a look at them, shall we? So, first one. Listen, what's that under your bed? Well, normally it's my little cat, and I do listen to her, so that's quite apt. 
So that's sort of a zombie fleshy as sort of inspired print. They they did a um, Star Trek set of these as well with sort of filmic posters. I got that somewhere. I'll have to dig it out, do a video on it. Uh, so that's sort of interesting, but not really that interesting. Time heist. So these don't seem to be in any order, but look at it. His mission, break into the most secure bank in the universe. Time heist. That's a nice sort of 1950s style poster. Quite like that one. That's the best so far. Caretaker. So this is like a Roman Polanski style film poster. A girl, a boy, a robot, and an alien. Interesting. Uh, Kill the Moon. I hated this episode. It started off so well and then it just became utter drivel. It's a sort of a, a strange love type poster. A mission to the unknown. <laughs> Doxy reference there. Yeah. Mummy on the Orient Express. So this is sort of an Art Deco poster. I do like that. That's sort of subdued but very nice. All who gaze upon the mummy shall die. Yeah, that's good. Flatline. I must rewatch this season. I don't remember most of these. Fear in two dimensions. Oh, that's the one where the aliens were two dimensional, turned people two dimensional, and the TARDIS shrank, and it was a bit of a mess. Nice poster there. Uh, in the forest of the night, which I think was that the one where the uh, London was turned into a forest. I might be wrong. That's right, that's sort of a, a um, sort of a, a children's fairy tale style poster. Dark water. Toy cat. You have a look? No, not interested. Oh, a Cyberman face. I like that. Dark water. That's really good. And what sort of style that would be classed as? It's almost like Italian horror style. I like that. Oh, St. Paul's in the background and the post office tower. Ah, uh, oh, this is nice. Death in heaven. The dead shall rise. There's Missy. Yeah, I think that's... So far, if I was putting one in a frame, it'd be this one. Uh, deep breath. That's Capaldi's first one, wasn't it, in London? So they're not in any sort of order in this envelope. I like that. That's alright. Subtle. Be good on a mug. Ooh. Into the Dalek. Uh, any uh, print with a Dalek on is fine by me. I do like that. What's he doing with his legs? I like that. That's good. What are you doing, Kat? Can you come and see it? And then, I think this must be the last one, yep, final one. I would say save the best to last, but we haven't. Uh, Robot of Sherwood, I thought it was a very lacklustre episode. Could have been quite funny, but wasn't really. Um, so yeah, so I think my favourite one is definitely the Cyberman one. That one, it's Death in Heaven. So really, for a fire, this is amazing value. These are really heavy duty card prints. Oh, from the back. Oh, and they've each got on the back all the same thing, I would imagine. Yeah, so yeah, I'm glad I picked them up. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. I've already got a, a wall full of stuff. Not much, got much wall room. Cat's going to shred them to pieces anyway by the look of it. Well done. Oh, good girl. Well, unfortunately, uh, the camera didn't record the final part, so we can uh, look at Maggie. Uh, just to say, well, uh, thanks for watching. If you want to see more unusual items like this, then please like and subscribe and let me know in the comments. And I'll see you again next time. So from Maggie and me, thanks then. Bye. Meow.